Weeks before Grenfell, a chilling warning. Kensington and Chelsea were told about the dangers of cladding fires just two months before the tragedy. In this letter, dated April 2017, the London Fire Brigade wrote to the council about external fire spread on tall buildings. Extracts of the correspondence were read out at the inquiry this afternoon. We've seen a number of cases where it appears on the basis of the information available to us that the level of fire protection to the external face of the building do not comply with the requirements of Part B of the building regulations insofar as they limit, seek to limit the speed at which a fire can travel and spread over the external face of a building or may contribute to a fire. I would therefore strongly urge that you consider this issue as part of the risk assessment process for premises under your control. This assessment will need to take account of other fire safety measures already in place in the building, as well as potential mitigation measures to ensure that any potential fire spread does not pose a risk to health and safety. The letter was passed on to the council's housing managers, the KCTMO, and their risk assessor, Carl Stokes, said Grenfell was compliant. Carl has asked a lot of questions about the Grenfell cladding and is happy that the material and the fixings are compliant. The inquiry asked KCTMO director Peter Madison if he checked the safety of the cladding with the specialist fire consultants on the job Exova. To be checked, the Exova uh, fire safety strategies or reports to see what they said about the cladding. Not in the context of this. I've, I've followed the advice and got uh, the, the fire risk assessor to, to consider this. Did you contribute to a response back to Laura Johnson? No. Was that ever done, as far as you're aware? I don't know. Other senior members of the council and the KCTMO are likely to be questioned about this when they appear at the hearing next month. Rags Martel, ITV News, The Grenfell Inquiry.